Well, we have breaking news now of uh, dangerous Muslims in the country. Uh, they've come up with a new gun called the Jihad gun. Uh, in it, uh, on this rifle, they have inscribed, and there's a translation for you guys, blessed be the Lord, my rock, who I presume that's Allah, right? Who trains my hands for war, my fingers for battle. God damn it, you see how dangerous these Muslims are? In fact, it has a safety on the gun, of course, and the safety that operates it has three settings. Peace, war, and God wills it. Now, God wills it. I mean, I, nothing sounded more Muslim than that, right? That's one of the central points of Islam, you know, that, hey, it's God's will, right? And so here they come, the dangerous Muslims again, ready to kill us all with their weaponry, with the verses from the Quran in it. Then why in the world does this guy look like he's Christian? Well, first of all, that's not the real guy. <laughs> but second of all, as you might have figured out if you watched the Young Turks for a while, it's not a Muslim. Uh, it's a Christian who has come up with a crusader gun. And in fact, that quote that I read you about killing everybody you don't like is from Psalm 144.1, from the Holy Bible. It's funny how uh, similar religious fundamentalists sound, isn't it? Okay. Now, we're against all of those religious fundamentalists, the Christians and the Muslims. All right, now, the guy in this case happens to be Ben Mookie Thomas. Uh, now, where's a guy named Mookie going to live who comes up with this kind of crusader gun? Oh, because there's only two choices, Texas and Florida, right? But this is wacky enough that it's got to be Florida. So, <laughs> of course, it's in Florida. It's Spikes Tactical in Apopka, Florida. So what does uh, Mookie say about this? He said, we want to make sure we built a weapon that would never be able to be used by a Muslim terrorist or to kill innocent people or advance their radical agenda. So does the gun blow up uh, if a Muslim terrorist touches it? How would it know? No, no, it's because of the Bible verse. Oh, uh, he, let's hear out Mookie. He says, off the cuff, I said, uh, I'd like to have a gun that if a Muslim terrorist picked it up, a bolt of lightning would hit and knock him dead. I mean, think about how crazy and fundamentalist he is in his own religion, that he thinks that if I put a Bible verse on a rifle where I'm going to kill people with this rifle, presumably, or deer, or whatever he's going to kill with, but if a Muslim picks up, oh, thank the Lord! <laughs> That's how it's going to work. Well, boy, that, this plan seems fail-safe. All right, one more pearl of wisdom from uh, Mookie. He says, uh, Thomas insisted, as they explained, that's Mookie Thomas, that Spike Tactical did not intend to insult or antagonize Muslims, although he admits that the company would never produce an AR-15 inscribed with verses from the Quran. Because their God wanting to kill people is totally ridiculous and crazy. Our God wanting to kill people, well, that's awesome. That's what he might made it for, so that uh, my hands of war and my fingers for battle are ready. But that's okay, that's for the Lord Almighty, not for their God. Okay, I'm glad you clarified that, Mookie. But you know, we got Mookie on tape here, so let's have a, a little bit more fun here and show you the genius who came up with the idea of the Crusader weapon. Hey, what's up? This is Mookie. They're letting us test out Spike's new rifle, the Crusader. Um, I came on board about a year ago, and at my first meeting, I had driven three hours listening to the news, and the owner asked me the question, Ben, what would you like to do with the rifle? What would you like on a rifle? And he was asking the question in regards to technical specifications, like the bolt, the barrel length, whatnot, and what have you. And I just blurted out in the meeting, I want a rifle that no Muslim terrorist can use to murder innocent people. What's awesome about this is the text. Psalm 144.1, blessed be the Lord my rock who trains my hands for war and my fingers for battle. This ensures that no Muslim terrorist will ever pick up this weapon to use it to bring harm against another person. That's actually my favorite part of the rifle. I love how slow this dude is. And I love that he thought he came up with a, oh, and then I thought of this. I said, well, if we put a Bible verse on it, the Muslim can't pick it up. <laughs> I got him. Good for you, good for you. Except that they would love that verse. I love that he doesn't get the irony of, you see how dangerous those guys are? And I love this Bible verse that says, my hands are made for war. <laughs> it's so violent and crazy over on the other side. <laughs> okay, now Mookie, can you show us how you would shoot those radicals? Oh, believe me, he can.
You see, if you kill Muslim radicals, the best way to do it, blah, 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 and then we'll seek their life. <laughs> throw that magazine. Throw it away. That, this was for the Lord Jesus. Damn violent Muslims. One more time.